today I'm going to show you five things you probably didn't know you could do with Windows 10. So let's get straight into it. Number one, pause in Windows updates. If you want to stop Windows updates temporarily, they can easily be paused by clicking on Start, Settings, Update and Security. Make sure Windows Update is selected, then pause updates. This will stop all Windows updates for seven days. If you want to pause them for longer than this, click on Advanced Options. Then just under Pause Updates, you can choose anything from one day and up to 35 days. After that, you can continue to use your computer normally. Then at any time, whenever you're ready to resume Windows Updates, click on Start, Settings, Update and Security, Resume Updates. Number two, see in the time in different countries. If you click on Start, Alarms and Clock, then World Clock, you can see a map of the world. On the brighter parts of the map, inside this line here, this is showing the places that are currently in daylight hours. If you want to see what the time is in a particular city, just click on Add New City, type in a city name into the search box, and when it appears, just click on it. Now you can clearly see that in England, it's about halfway through the day, whereas in Los Angeles, they're just about to start a new day. You can add plenty of places to the map if you want to, so that you can see the current time in many places, and you can easily see if they're in daylight hours right now. Number three, changing the look of the start menu. You can change the size of the start menu by clicking on start, then dragging the box up or down, left or right. Change the size of any tile by right clicking on one, selecting resize, then choose one of the options given such as small, large or wide. You can remove a tile by right clicking on it and choosing unpin from start or move a tile by dragging it. If you want to add one of the apps to this section, find the app you want, right click on it, select pin to start, and it will show up here. And you can create a folder by dragging one tile onto another. There are some more options for changing the start menu, which can be seen by clicking on start, settings, Personalization, Start. Here there are certain options that can be turned on or off, such as Show More Tiles, Show Recently Added Apps, and Show Most Used Apps. So as you can see, you can customize the Start menu quite a lot. Number four, seeing what's taking up space on your computer. If you click on Start, Settings, System, then Storage, you can see how much free space your computer has and how much has been used. And here you can see how much storage space is being used by various categories such as apps and features, other, which is large folders, temporary files and your documents. To see more categories, click on show more categories and scroll down to see them all. If your computer has a second drive, you can click on View Storage Usage on Other Drives, choose the one you want to view, and here are all the categories for the second drive. This is a good way of seeing what's taking up most of the space on your computer. And finally, number five, turning on Windows Dark Mode. To turn on Windows Dark Mode, click on Start, Settings, Personalization, then Colors. Then under Choose Your Colour, select Dark. This will give many of your windows a dark look. You can also do this with YouTube. Just go to YouTube, click on the three dots in the top right corner, choose Appearance, then Dark Theme, and it will change instantly. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next video.